don't even mind what I'm wearing right now. It's the same shirt from the other day. Um, it was the only one I had, so shut up. Uh, but anyway, um, you know the whole Baltimore group that we talked about, you know, like a week or two ago? Um, yeah, that got withdrawn. So now the, um, the guy who owns all the IP and stuff, he's all whining on Facebook and whatnot and stuff like that, you know. So the NAL is in a bad position right now. CIF, nothing. Um, indoor Football League, right now, looks like those three franchises that Roy Choi owns, looks like they're going away. Cedar Rapids, um, San Diego, maybe Oakland. Um, but I mean, Marshawn Lynch is also an owner, so, you know, give me the ball at the one yard line at the Super Bowl, you know. Um, but, uh, yeah, those three franchises might be going away. And, uh, I mean, Massachusetts was added, you know, last week. So, things are looking interesting as far as that goes. Um, but we'll find out, you know, shortly, you know, as things go on, you know, more about what the indoor football landscape is, you know. And... At the end of the day, you know, IFL is still top dog. NAL is trailing behind. CIF has done nothing. They're they're in a bad position. They're in a bad position as well, you know. And you know, COVID has messed up everything too. So, and I don't know what in the world the AAL is doing. They're adding teams left and right. You know, it's it's uh, the ABA. Um, in the World Football League, so, you know. So, who knows? But, again, we'll find out more information soon, you know, because things fluctuate, circulate, do all sorts of things, and all these rumors come in and out like wildfire. So, we'll find out more again soon. And I'm Big Boy Variety, and we'll see you in the next video very, very shortly.